am by no means a professional music producer. I'm actually a computer science student in my last semester of college. As you can imagine, free time can be hard to come by. Probably explains my upload schedule. Today is Thursday, October 11th, 2018, and my school's fall break just started, which means I don't have classes Thursday and Friday this week, so I'm taking advantage of this free time to document what it's like being an amateur music producer while also being an engineering student in college. My main goal after the end of this week is to release my first EP. Even though I didn't formally have lectures Thursday, I still had to drive on campus to work on a group project. We didn't have much food at the apartment, so breakfast was on campus. Not a bad meal to start the break. Afterwards, we were able to go grocery shopping, so now we had plenty of food for the next week. And then finally, in the mid-afternoon, I had some free time to work on producing music. Now, at this point, I had four songs in the works that I deemed worthy enough of being released. So my personal goal was to finalize one song per day of break. Today's song I call Morning Dew. I enjoy the chorus, especially I love the second half of the second drop. I'm really proud of that. But I wasn't so keen on the intro that I had. I feel like it didn't quite mesh with the overall tone of the other songs and just seemed generally uninspired. So my big focal point was cleaning that up. And also I took some time to polish up some strings in the bridge and tinkered with the buildup as well. It always feels good to formally complete a song, to actually export it and just call it finished. I've been sitting on some of these works in progress for months and I'm pretty happy to finally release them. Some very exciting news came today. I had been in touch with an artist to commission a painting for the album art. They had been occasionally filling me in on progress updates and I was extremely excited when I heard that the final product was complete. Honestly, it looks outstanding. I am absolutely in love with it. Infinitely better than anything I would have come up with. So to the artist on the offhand chance that you're watching Watching this right now, thank you so so much. The day wrapped up with a nice home cooked meal and some drinks. I was able to play some games with my brother for the first time in a while, so overall it was a nice comfy night in. I started Friday off by working on a group project, something I also really haven't had the time to work on recently, but I've been meaning to whenever I got the chance, so here we are. After a few hours passed, I started editing the footage for this video from yesterday, and then at about 12.15 I had to leave for a very important job interview. Later in the day, we went Halloween costume shopping, and at night we carved some pumpkins. I didn't really have much time to squeeze in music production work, but hopefully tomorrow will be more productive. It wasn't. Okay, so I did manage to do some work on my capstone project for a few hours in the morning, but come the afternoon, football started, so nothing productive really got done for the rest of the day. Sunday was slightly less hectic than the past two days, but I did spend most of the day working on schoolwork again. However, when I wasn't working on school, I was able to squeeze in a quick workout and then finally some time to work on music. Today, I focused on a song I call Filet, something slightly different than what I'm used to making. For that reason, it was fun to make and I really enjoy the different elements of this song, but I didn't quite enjoy some of the sound design that I had on the leads. So I went to working on improving that until I was satisfied and finally called this song complete. I already had most of the song finished anyways, so that didn't take too much time. So I also went to working on another track to kind of get back on schedule, this time focusing on a song I call Drift. I've been sitting on the song for over six months, but I've never really gotten around to finishing it. The upside of it being so old was that it was practically finished in my eyes, since I've already had so much time to polish it up. All I had to do was go back and apply some recently gained music production knowledge to clean up the overall mix, and I called it done. The night wrapped up with another delicious delicious home-cooked meal, topped off by catching up on some of our favorite shows. It's Monday, so fall break is over. I went on campus early in the morning, and I started off my day by editing the footage for this video from the past few days. I then met up with a project group to get caught up on what everyone was working on, and then went to my first and only lecture. In the afternoon, I continued to work on some school projects, and eventually got around to finalizing the album art using the commissioned painting. This is where I officially named the EP Dreamland.
Similar to Monday, I got on campus early in the morning and started my day off by editing this video. After that, I had to give a presentation on our time box submission in capstone class, and then I ate some lunch. I went to another lecture, and then I finally got to come back home. At this point, I went to working on the final song in the EP, Home With You. This is my favorite song of the whole bunch, which is why I decided to save it for last, to end on a good note. While I am extremely proud of the song, I noticed some minor issues in my first draft, notably being an accident accidental lack of side chaining on the second drop. Once that was cleaned up, I considered the song to be finished. So now all the songs are done, exported, they're ready to go. Later in the night, I worked on creating a banner to be used as a way to promote the EP on my channel and sites such as SoundCloud. All the songs are finished, the album art is done, there's only one thing left to do to complete the EP, and that's to release it. I do my music distribution through an awesome site called DistroKid, where publishing my songs to dozens of major platforms is super simple and super cheap. Which brings us back to Thursday, one week later. In just one week, I was able to finalize four songs for my first ever EP and publish it to the world. Dreamland comes out November 3rd. If you're so inclined, pre-order links are in the description of this video, so you can be an awesome person and get it as soon as it's released. Also, if you wanna use DistroKid for yourself, like I did to release Dreamland, I also have a nifty little link in the description that lets you get 7% off your first year's purchase. That's less than $20 to release unlimited songs to hundreds of platforms such as Spotify, iTunes, Google Play, etc. And that was a week in the life of a music producer in college. Thanks for watching. <laughs>